and the way it works is it takes off like a helicopter and flies like an airplane in flight. So um, takes off and land vertically. It can hover at what we say we call it 6K95. What that what that means to to those who may not understand that it's 6,000 feet, 95 degrees, which means very low density air, and uh, that's that's tough for helicopters. So so this this uh, this aircraft, this tilt rotor, can uh, hover out of ground effect at 6K95, and it can fly at 280 knots of forward airspeed, which is uh, more than twice um, most conventional helicopters. Uh, a squad of soldiers in the back, um, and essentially we see this as uh, as not only the uh, the assault platform of the future but also uh, the, uh, the attack platform going forward. This has a, a tail wheel instead of a, instead of a nose wheel. <clears throat> um, the reason why we did that is once, once we made this a, a side door aircraft as opposed to having a ramp, uh, the B-22 has a ramp. Obviously, you could not have a tail wheel on a B-22 because of that ramp the troops kept come out. But once we made this a side door aircraft that allowed us to, to use a tail wheel, and what that does is instead of the nose uh, having to accommodate that nose landing gear, we could put sensors or weapons up there. And, uh, and make the aircraft uh, more capable for our customers. The cockpit of the future, so the, the system that we're going to fly with the demonstrator is, is much more conventional. It's a glass cockpit, but it's, it's made up of uh, individual uh, multifunctional displays. This is where we see it going in the future, one continuous display. And the, and the good thing about this is there's, there's pieces of the display uh, are, are independent and interlinked, so if one, if one piece were to go out, you don't lose the entire screen. But essentially, this allows the pilot to put his instrumentation wherever he wants. So wherever he wants to look at his attitude indicator or his, his azimuth indicator, he can put that wherever he wants. He can put his MFDs wherever he wants, make them whatever size he wants, and tailor this, tailor this cockpit to the way he wants to, to fly. Now, if, they want to, if, if the customer wants this to be standard, we can do that. But if the customer wants it to be flexible, we can do that. The, the, the beauty is that uh, our view is the more flexibility we can provide to our customer, um, the better it is for him.